Hey everybody, welcome back to Fawin Channel. Um, as you may remember from the last episode, we took the fight to the Orcs and we found their main base, and now we're gonna try to take it out. But that last mission, we took some serious losses, so yeah, we're going to uh, we're gonna go see if we can repair up so we can actually fight these assholes. Uh... Excalibur, honestly, Excalibur, you don't really need it all that bad. I can, you can sit this one out for a couple of turns. Um, okay. So we're gonna go take the fight to the orc's main base, which is on a big space hulk. Where'd it go? The hunt. The assault force is ready to launch the attack on the space hulk. Captain Abradol's support fleet is in place to support you. Abradol! Keep in mind that the Orcs will defend their base with everything they've got. I recommend that you select large ships armed with torpedoes and long-range weaponry to use against the Colossus. Remember, you must destroy the Space Hulk to okay. ensure that the Orcs are no longer a threat to our supply lines. You got it, buddy. So, lots of big ships. Destroy the Space Hulk Colossus with a K. <laughs> So yeah, a bunch of big ships, pump it full of torpedoes, just like we did with Abaddon's Planet Killer, as well as the um, the Blackstone Fortress. And I thought one of y'all had special torpedoes, but I'm not seeing it. What's this? Faster, uh, longer range. Okay. So this is what we got. A bunch of heavy ships. Let's do it. Captain Abradol, we've reached the asteroid field. Our target, the Space Hulk, lies ahead. Sir, the Orga arrays are reporting multiple signals in the asteroid field. It's difficult to make out which ones are enemy ships and which are just rocks moving around. Follow the beacon, Abradol. That should take us right into the Orc base. Oh, that must be it. I've identified the Space Hulk. It's moving towards us. By the throne, it's enormous. You. This is Captain Crash Cruise. Crash I've got Cruise. the boss here, and all these boys answer to me. I don't know what you humans are doing. I love his hat. <laughs> with my cruisers and the Colossus. Is using the Space Hulk as a battleship. Insanity. Oh, no, that's about right. Give us the strength to prevail against these Xenos filth. All ships, battle stations. On the bright side, because he's so big, we can just shoot at him from long range, I feel. Where am I? Okay. Now, for those of you who don't know what a Space Hulk is, a Space Hulk is a bunch of spaceships and, and space debris and uh, asteroids that all just kind of clump together to form one big, like, thing. Okay, we're gonna deploy here. It looks like these don't count as asteroids. They look like just broken ships, so... Enemy ship sighted! Oh. Okay, there he is. So, what we wanna do... Your orders? Is get a firing lane set up and just try to just pump them full of torpedoes. Resuming normal functions. Okay. Cruising speed set. So all of you guys stop. And I want you to actually just turn and bring these guys to bear. Resuming normal functions. Execute high energy turn. Get him in range. A little more. Awaiting orders. Yep. 
You cruising speed set. Come on. And fire. Your orders. And you do the same deal. Cruising speed set. Little bit more. Execute high energy turn. There we go. That's what we want. Yes, Admiral. Come on, hit him. Can I zoom in on these things? Yeah, I can actually. <laughs> Your Colossus is a mighty beast, sacred to Gorgon Mork. I got lots of Dacker on board. Oh, he got some spaceships. Be my target practice. Engines hot. So we got another friend around here. He's on the other side of this. Oh, well, at least we got him on fire. Ship ready. Reload. 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 Reloading. Course plotted. Your orders underway. Yes, Admiral. Activating tactical cogitators. Cruising speed set. At your command. Uh, we haven't really done much damage to him. He's repaired for the most part. What are you doing? You're thinking about what you're doing. Okay. Resuming normal functions. Oh, that's a shit ton of guys. Or, uh, torpedoes. Awaiting orders. Awaiting orders. Changing course. For the Emperor. Enemy ship sighted. Ooh. Orders received. No. Shit. I just like ran into all my stuff. Enemy ship sighted. Your orders. Ship ready. Acquiring new vector. Ugh, this is not good. Enemy ship sighted. And we just lost the big ship. Fuck! I can't get anything yes, to bear. Execute high energy turn. Cruising speed set. You're gonna die. Yes, Admiral. You're gonna die. Reloading. Acquiring new vector. Cruising speed set. Hey, stop destroying my ship. That's an order. Fire everything, boys. 
Shake the jack cannons! Shake the torpedoes! Shake the mega guns! Throw some drops out at the cavalry windows so they can't see us! Engines! <laughs> what? <sighs> We've lost one of our ships! Yeah, no, we have. Oh, I know we have. The navigator will guide us out. You can try to run. I don't think you're going to do very well with it. Now you're engaging very far away. I'm hoping that you can actually do some real damage. I've done what I can at this point. Engines to maximum. Damage teams, begin repairs now. Understood. Uh, on. Setting course. Fuck you, man. Changing course. I don't know what that was, but thank you. Victor. And pump you full of torpedoes! Orders received. Ugh. Something. Ship sighted. Ah, I can't land any guys over there? All ahead, full. Boom up! You're on fire. I'm hoping that'll be enough. Course plotted. I think we did it. My secret weapons gonna cramp all of yours. Admiral, the orc must have captured the cyclonic torpedo from an ancient imperial ship. I don't know what that is. Possibly from the era of the Great Crusade. Don't know what that is. These are used for exterminators. Oh shit! Oh, he's gonna blow himself up and take us all with him. Ah, oh, at least we destroyed their pirate base. Yep, it's it's dead. Well, that's good. Probably something went our way. <laughs> oh, it's not blown up. No, that counts as a victory. It's on fire. Victorious. Woohoo! Everything's dead except for the truth and reconciliation. <laughs> oh man! Seriously, is eight the cap? Like that's hardly going up. I'm surprised nobody leveled up from that. You're close. Ugh. Oh. <laughs> so what does that mean? Does that mean something? The orc horde is a beast. You yep. destroy the head, the body dies. Without their war boss, the orc ships become easy prey. Oh, look at them. We're just one coming in. By one. We hunted them down, dispensing the Emperor's implacable wrath. So now it's just chaos with the fight, vessels. right? Our attack scattered their ships, and the once fearsome green tide was silenced. Oh, that's so good. That's so rewarding, actually. Admiral Spire. Yes! The destruction it's of the gone! Space Hulk we just has got been chaos! by several nearby systems. Without their leader, the Orcs' attacks will be disorganized and easily fended off. The Gothic Sector oh. is no longer in danger from the Greenskin Pirates. Thanks to your efforts, several planetary governors and nobles have promised us more resources and personnel for the war. Woohoo! The Imperial Navy is stronger than ever now. Congratulations are in order, Admiral Spire. You've won a great battle, and I believe more victories are in your future. Oh, that is so satisfying. All efforts to bring down that Space Hulk are already paying off. With their base, without their base, the orcs are now unable to oppose anything we couldn't destroy. And it seems they are aware of that, as their attacks have ceased and they have fled the occupied systems. Orcs are no longer a threat, and any orc-controlled systems are now under Imperium control once more. The orc threat has been removed, and orc control worlds have been given back. Sweet. Which means the only thing that's left is chaos and the traitors. Uh, and honestly, it looks more like the orc ones went to the traitors. <laughs> okay. Well, that's it for uh, our deployments. Ah. Uh, 
You know what? We're just going to hit end turn and see what happens. 147! I have dire news. Oh, shit. Abaddon's fleet has attacked the Fularis system, the location of Blackstone Fortress 1. I sent a rescue fleet into the system, and they brought back a personal log of Lieutenant <sighs> Elijah Borgia of the Vindictive, Borgia. a Dominator class cruiser. We discovered the wreckage of the Vindictive drifting towards the central star of Fularis. Admiral Spire, listen carefully to the log we recovered. I believe you will find it very <sighs> illuminating. The way you talk to me is like I'm always we in are trouble. Luck today. Abaddon's fleet has attacked from the other side of Fularis too, which means they'll have to risk the orbital and planetary defense systems to get to Blackstone 1. We have only just upgraded our weapons on Fularis 2 for just such an occurrence. And I doubt that even with his two fortresses, our enemy will survive. Lord Admiral, the system seems like they're prepared for a serious fight. Surely they must have dealt significant damage to the Chaos Fleet. Listen to the rest of the log, Spire. The two Blackstones have taken up station 5,000 leagues from each other, some 75,000 leagues from Phalaris II, and just out of range of the weapons platforms, except for the torpedo launchers. We're picking up an energy surge in the two fortresses. They're powering up for something. Tech Priest Flavix says there's some kind of energy exchange between them. Hmm, Empress that doesn't sound Chief. good. I can see it myself now. A column of shifting energy linking the two fortresses together. The surge is still rising. The power beam becoming more visible. The damned Astropath is screaming now, yelling something about a breach into warp space. What hellspawn trick are they up to? Oh my. The personal log ends Ooh. here. The other evidence we recovered from the region points toward a beam of warp energy unleashed upon Fularis 2. Oh, they just the death started. The was fully caught in the blast. Its void shields overloaded instantly, and its outer hull vaporized as the energy wave passed over the ship. Blackstone Fortress 1 has not been found. We must assume that Abaddon now has three Blackstone Fortresses <sighs> under his command. That's not good. Uh, well, what's this? Oh, I guess it's under Eldar protection. Okay, so what do we got? What do we have? We have an assassination one to help out the Imperial Navy. Um, and that's it. Okay, we got four deployments. Let's go check our fleet status because a lot of our stuff was fucked up in the last mission. Yep. Particularly you guys. I will repair right now. Eh, yeah, you know, I can use the other two for now. That's fine. That's fine. We're fine. Everything's cool. Okay, let's find the special mission. Oh, actually, yeah, no, no, it's Imperial Navy. So what's up? Attack or three, assassination, destroy the enemy target ship in time. Okay. We'll take one of the regular cruisers with us. Uh, we'll take the HMS Pinnacle. And... I don't think I should take one of these. I think I should take a bunch of uh, torpedo ships. So then we can just pump them full of torpedoes. Let's do it! And I should have some Imperial Navy guys follow me too. Look at all those guns on the side of that ship. Ah! Oh, I freaking love these guys. Though I think the Eldar look cooler. <laughs> Destroy targeted Admiral ship. He's a corn guy. Look at all that red. Blood for the blood god. Okay, so we're gonna pile ourselves in the middle. And just go straight after him. Yep. Enemy ship sighted. Where is he? He's over there. Okay. And front facing everybody six. Go. Engines to maximum. Where's our buddy? 
uh, he's over there with um, just a couple of ships. That's fine. All ahead, full. Enemy ship sighted. I want to get close and just fire a Enemy shit ton of sighted. things into him. Cruising speed set. There we go. Hull breach already? Yes, oh wow, we're losing everything like super quick. That's your command. Orders received. That's not good. We're not gonna win this one, I don't think. So. Ship ready. Initiate emergency repairs. Engines to maximum. Yes, Admiral. Yeah, maybe we should took some bigger ships. Your orders? What do you have? Imperial you have a battleship? Engage closer, please. At your command. Get in there closer. Get the hell out of the way of my missiles. Ugh, it's a long spread, but we can get at them. Targeting enemy vessel. Ah, uh, we still got a minute. Underway. Get his engines. Awaiting orders. That's what we want. Helm coordinates acknowledged. Five. Four. We've lost an escort three, ship. Dose. Nah. Understood. That's fine. Eat this shit. Initiate emergency repairs. Engines hot. Two, one. All ahead, full. Setting course. Let's see about plowing straight in India. Cruising speed set. Oh, Underway. you're trying to do that too, eh? Trying to avoid me! You're trying to avoid this! Boom! <laughs> Cruising speed set. Gotcha. Gotcha. You're dead, bitch. <laughs> when in doubt, ram him. <laughs> I think I've won more battles that way, especially in the later game. Just plow straight through them. Screw them. The game, <laughs> the game duration was three minutes. Uh, oh, HMS Pitiful is level seven. Good job, Captain Cochran. Yeah, that thing is not growing. I think eight is the uh, uh, cap. Hoo hoo hoo! Which means now we got another favor from them. Um, let's uh, let's try to get this guy to grow some more. So there should be at least one somewhere. This one. Oh, it's data. Rec I freaking hate data recovery missions. Which one was it? Arf? Seven hundred points. Okay, we're gonna do this next time because we're getting we're getting over the time limit right now. So, thanks again for watching, everybody. Uh, this episode we destroyed the orcs. We got them out of the way. Now we just have to deal with the chaos menace. Um, thanks again for watching. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share, and uh, follow Fawin Channel on Instagram and Twitter. And I will see you guys next time as we try to take back more of these worlds. Take care, guys.